finally, in terms of society, we also believe that organizations have to give something back to the society. So, for Marico, we have started Marico Innovation Foundation. This began in the year 2003. And we have done various, we have taken various initiatives in this area. We have done research studies in innovation. We have come up with a book on innovation, which has sold something like 60,000 copies. Uh, every two years, we have awards where we award innovators. And of late, we have started what we call scale-up programs for highly innovative organizations. We realized that many organizations are innovating in small pockets, and they don't know how to scale up. So if we actually um, work with them, and if we help them scale up, then the impact of the innovation will be far more. So with that, we, on an average, we work with about six to nine innovative organizations and help them scale up. Um, and I think that, again, has uh, improved the organization's image. So what I wanted to say was this, all the stakeholders are interconnected. And uh, it so happened that after we came out with our purpose, I happened to read a book which was written by uh, Raj Sisodi and Jagdish Shet. And the book, name of the book is Firms of Endearment. It's a very good book. It is basically, they compared a set of publicly traded companies in US with 11 good to great companies. And what they found out was that the good companies, firms of endearment, which they had identified, which were actually giving something to all the stakeholders, were, had outperformed all the good to, to great companies on a huge, by a huge margin. So I think that just reinforced the belief in me that I think organizations don't just exist for shareholders or promoters, they exist for all the stakeholders. And leadership is very, very critical in this. Uh, it's very important that leadership calls the shot. So purpose makes the true leadership possible. So with this, uh, I want to end my talk. Thank you very much.